Hello everyone, welcome back to uh, Climbing System. So in previous video we stopped here. Okay. So the character is not uh, that it goes out of our control, but you know it, it moves to the height. We will get those things set up here. So come to our uh, base character. So here we will we need to do a couple of things. So, like move left and right, we need uh, move up and down also. Because when we are on ledge, uh, we, we need to know whether uh, uh, the, the character is trying to move up or not. And uh, this x, I don't think we need the value as it is. So divide it by divide by twenty. So this twenty value I'm matching with animations which I have, uh, like the move left and move right. So if you are using uh, any other animations apart from Mixamo, this value you might need to uh, play off a bit so that uh, your your uh, character movement is uh, realistic. So now uh, we we will create couple of variables here and write will be a boolean and can move left. Okay. So here can move right and moving left right is greater than 0 so if this move right left value is uh, greater than 0 then we are uh, pressing uh, the d key which is the right uh, move right key and if it is less than 0 that means we are uh, uh, pressing a key that is move left key so put add in branch here And similarly for uh, the other uh, side. Okay. Here instead of greater than, we need to put less than. And. Uh, one more thing what we need to pass here is uh, moving left right so this is the scale value okay. so this should work okay so now the character is uh, not moving left or right because we haven't uh, coded that but the character has moved to a position it's still in the poly set if you press i you can see the character move mode is uh, applying and movement state is in climb but uh, we haven't set the uh, uh, animation uh, bp for the climb mode so once we set that our character will be uh, you know uh, getting to the right uh, animation that has to play when it is in climb state so we will set that so go to your animation BP which is under character assets mannequin skeleton and alias anim BP. So before we go to anim BP we have to create an interface to pass the details from our uh, climbing system to uh, the anim BP. So create an interface here. Climb interface and within the interface create a function climb values and on output add a few values here. Thanks 
so this is the enum we created in the first step then moving left so these, these variables will be uh, uh, creating in future right I think this, this should be fine for now. We will add further variables whenever we require. Now come to uh, climbing component in uh, class settings. Add the interface we created. Climb interface. And on the interface, double click here. So we will pass the values here, uh, which is simple. Uh, we have the variables already. Just you know, we just need to redirect them here. And moving left and right, we haven't created it, so we will create it here. Left, moving right, and just connect them here. Okay, now we have to add this interface on the anim BP. Come to ALS anim BP and uh, do the you know same thing class settings. Client interface. Okay. Now uh, we have to cast the player here, and uh, from there we have to pass the uh, uh, variables. So for that, uh, the usual way how we do on the event graph, put in a small delay. Uh, point two or point one seconds should be fine, and cast to player character put the player character and promote this to a variable name it as creator ok now on the update graph go here uh, open this update character info so we already have uh, uh, ALS passing few details here so we will add ours also just to have everything in the uh, you know same place uh, get player ref and from player ref get the client with the climb values and we will convert this to a validate get uh, so if in case if we are not able to uh, uh, cast to the player character properly this doesn't fail it, it just uh, you know gets captured in the next iteration and uh, uh, gets done and uh, promote these variables the same names so that it will be easy for us to manage or uh, find issues okay so this is fine uh, for now now uh, go to our uh, anim graph so here uh, we have to uh, set somewhere uh, to use uh, a different state machine when uh, the character is uh, in in climb state okay so what we will do is just copy all these move it here break this pin and uh, put it to a cached post new cached post and uh, name it as default post so now we have different uh, states being uh, handled here. So on the default post, connect our uh, default cache post. Okay. 
we already have uh, uh, state machine set for our ragdoll state so similarly we will add one for our uh, climb state also click on climb you'll get the climb post here and uh, create a new state machine climb state and uh, cache this also now connect this uh, climb state post to there Okay. Now let's see how it behaves. So here we don't have any state. That's the warning. But uh, uh, our our code should run. It should go to uh, A post. Okay. So this is what is expected. So now the player is in uh, climb state now. If you press I, the character move mode is in flying. Movement state is climb. So uh, we have to add animations uh, within the uh, climb uh, state. Okay, I'll stop it here. Uh, see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.